So here's another video booked to you. Hi, I'm still driving, so I thought I would still talk to you. Um, in the last couple days, I finished a couple books, neither of which were on the TBR that me and Zoe did the other day. <clears throat> so it's just like typical me shit. Um, one of them was from an author I've never even heard of before, and I don't know how I missed this guy, but um, I think it's John Fonte. Um, and I read this book called uh, Ask the Dust, and it was amazing. I absolutely loved it. Um, it had a great ending, which is huge for me because a lot of a lot of anything, uh, books, film, TV, whatever, a lot of people seem to screw the ending, and this ending was so right for the book. Um, but it's another one of those um, down on your luck writer guy types um, in Los Angeles. So there was a lot of relatable shit there for me. Um, and then there were just little things. Like, I don't want to ruin anything because this was like kind of a big deal for me when I was reading it. But like, there was all this shit going on. And then all of a sudden, there's like a fucking giant earthquake and like massive damage and people are dead and all this stuff but it happens in the middle of him going through some other fucking thing and it was just so real how that all happened I just I, I, I can't gush about it enough and on top of that what really um, kind of ticked me off not really, but kind of, I found out it was the third book out of four. So, um, Arturo Bandini is, um, the character. And so, um, I gotta go find, and because these books aren't, I, they're just not everywhere, I guess. Um, like, yeah, I found them on Amazon and stuff, but that was kind of, um, the extent. I don't know if I go into a bookstore if I would ever run across them. Um, but they were great, or that one was great, and I can't wait to read the other ones. <clears throat> the second one I read, it was the first Dostoevsky book I read. Um, so yeah, my accent's horrible, and every time I think about it, I say it wrong, but Fyodor Dostoevsky, um, Notes from the Underground, which was really really fun. Like, not fun, like, ooh, we're having a party. But the way it was written was really weird. Like, th this first chunk of the book was very, like, philosophical. And to me, gave a completely different impression of what this guy, the narrator, was like. And then the rest of the book is this, like, a, uh, experience he goes through. And then you, it, it, it's just this whole thing where you get one impression about somebody and then as real crap goes down, you realize, wow, that's not at all how I thought or hoped this person would act in this situation kind of thing. Um, but it was really, really good. And this book ended in a way that wasn't bad, but I think it was exactly how that character would end a story. Um, yeah, so if you haven't read it, definitely check it out. Um, it's just basically about a guy who is part of the system, and then he's fucking tired of it, and he goes into the underground. Um, and then... I feel like he can't really cope with it as much as he thought he would be able to. So, I don't know. Anyway, I am at my destination, so I will chat with you guys later.